Revealing the vocal break. Some voice coaches state their claim to fame on their ability to mask the vocal break. But what if from a stylistic standpoint, you would like to reveal it? How do you do that? Yole, 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 Or sing a Leanne Rhymes song. Blue. Step one, what you need is a clear, strong chest voice. And if you are a true soprano and head voice is your strength, you might have difficulty with this particular thing. You're gonna have to clearly define that contrast between the dramatic chest voice sound and the lighter head voice sound. And in order to do that, you need to strengthen those compression muscles. That's if you're a soprano in the chest voice ranges, okay? So here's an exercise that'll help you to do that. Using a dopey kind of tone, alternate between the B consonant and D consonant while performing a simple five note major scale. Also note that the exercise decreases rather than increases chromatically as we head lower into the chest voice range. Step two, you've got to be able to orient yourself pitch-wise on both sides of the passaggio, okay? You will be moving from one register to the next. You have to make sure that you're not pitchy when doing so. So check this exercise out, moving from ah in the chest voice to in the head voice. Oh, can you go ahead and try that? Oh. All right, we're going to maintain the same pitch in the chest voice and change the pitch of the head voice note. So, oh. go ahead. Oh. Again, oh. same note in the chest, Change the pitch of the head. Ah, go ahead. One more time. Ah, go ahead, try it. Okay. Ah, try that. All right, here goes. Ah, give it a shot. Ah, in the chest. Now let's hear that same note in the head voice. Oh, how did that work out for you? Step three, if you happen to be a tenor, a baritone, or a bass who's looking to perfect this skill, um, I'd have to categorize you between those who have a head voice and those who do not, or who have a head voice that's kind of weak. You need a head voice to do this, all right? So uh, let's develop that real quick. In order to develop the head voice, you have to sort of use the ooh vowel and just try a little bit, sort of make some sounds. Ooh, try that real quick. Ooh, or let's pretend you're at a basketball game and your team just scored the goal. Ooh, you're gonna make a sound like that maybe, all right? Ooh, ooh, all right, try some of those, okay? And then what I'd ask you to do is using the ooh vowel, ooh, just try that. Ooh, go ahead. Ooh, all right, tenor. So this is your exercise. Ooh, 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 ooh. ooh. One more time. Ooh, ooh, 